Hi from the command center GW Solar USA. Guys, what we have here is a Fluke 1587 FC insulation multimeter. So what we're gonna do here, we're gonna be doing a, a wire test. So this is a very expensive machine and uh, is a professional level. Oh. Yeah, the wires. And we have a lot of wires that uh, get pulled from a solar field, a solar farm here. So I'm collecting right now from a close friend that works with the solar farms. He's a uh, guy that goes normally do maintenance on all these solar farms all over uh, Minnesota, Iowa, other places. So what we do here, I think he's uh, grounding the wire by using a, a screwdriver and had one of it plugged to the fluke. And this is a 600 volt cat four and a thousand volt cat three all right <laughs> oh, so we're gonna do a wire test to see how hey leave it everything i need it there yeah, like see. a run now I, and it's showing good but he had it plugged to no well, it ain't gonna work there it goes and that's the meter right there see so, if it's not touching the ground, it's going to read good. So it ain't going to work because we're not in the racking. It's not going to work. So Bam. it has to be grounded now. Because I touched it. You touched it and no, I'm not. open air, yep. nothing. So if it's not faulting, it ain't going to work. So you can, that means you can bury this wire by touching the ground is okay. I can, if I, if that was in the ground, I'd find the fault. But okay. now since so, it's free aired, mm -hmm. see, can I see that bud? So good wire is a 10,000. Yeah, now, now step off that. VOC, and I'm stepping off from. There you go. There's no see. resistance to ground. Look at that, where wires I'm getting right here. So we winding all these wires. You got a few spots there. So it's gonna be um, the fifth round here. 215 feet long on string. And uh, we wind it up so we have uh, black, red, black, red. So this is the fifth wire coming in and the sixth is here so that's going to be for three string solar ray 215 feet long look at all this wire all he's going to do with it just strip it for copper and waste it <laughs> sell it so it goes all the way down the property those three line you seen right there past the uh pink cone right there See the wire? So that's our 215 feet and all the way down, down, and the ends has the MC4 connectors. So I'm gonna be, I'm getting, uh, the ones right there is picking up. It's already a total of three strings and I'm buying another set of three strings. So I'm gonna be having about six strings now I have the opportunity to do it, then I'm just going to do it and get that long all the way. So let me show you this. You got a bunch of them here because you just pulled them from a solar farm like I, was, I mentioned. Because some of them, when they install the, condo, the, the wires on the ground and the installers didn't get the uh, lock the side of the conduit. And... Uh, mice get in there hey no they're trying to make nests and they were just happy with uh 800 and 800 volts they were sending for grid tide inverters on the solar field and uh, they were feeling warm in there so later they started chewing these wires having some snack so we got a bunch of wires here i can buy 
and uh, some of them has few things that are burned you see how the mice eat that you see look at the wire they eat that side so I'm getting the ones that are really good these are seven strands here into it you can see seven strands it's pure copper and these are UV rated and uh, you are listed for underground burial like and subscribe GW Solo USA thanks for watching like and subscribe bye